Today is Tuesday the 30th of January and as you can see today I received not one, not two, not three, not four, but five lots of autographs in the post. So to mark this momentous occasion where I actually get more than one, I'm going to open them all on camera for you. So let's go! So the first one is a recent one I believe. Let's have a look. Oh, it's Greg Davis. Oh my God, yes. Thank you, Greg. Now, this was a via venue success and I didn't expect to get it back, I won't lie. The show was on Sunday and to be honest, I wasn't expecting to get it back. I sent it to the theatre in my hometown and they're very hit and miss with mail. But I'm very happy it actually worked. I signed this one to Daniel Best Wishes, Greg. This one is just signed. And this one is put to Daniel Best Wishes, Greg. I absolutely love these. So for those of you who don't know, Greg Davis is a comedian and an actor. I know him best for playing Mr Gilbert in The Inbetweeners and he also played King Hydroflax in Doctor Who. And I'm very happy to have his autograph in my collection again. These are my first personalised ones and my first Doctor Who ones and I'm very excited to add them to that folder. So yeah. The first autograph I received today was a via venue success from Greg Davis. Thank you, Greg. Now for the second one, let's have a look. Oh, this one's quite sick. Please, can't even get my hand out. Oh, it's Brian Cranston. Oh my God, finally. Oh my god, two Daniel. Roar! Oh my god, that happened. I'm not doing that again. I don't even know if I'm going to keep that part in the video. What the fuck? Two Daniel, Roar, Brian Cranston. Thank you, Brian. Two Daniel, Brian Cranston. That's Brian Cranston. This is my favourite film. I absolutely love Why Him. It's so funny. And Get a Job is signed just Brian Cranston. Oh, 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 and to Danielle Brian Cranston. And he's put some cardboard in that I didn't send. Thank you very much for this lovely picture. So yeah, another via venue success that took absolute fucking ages from Brian Cranston. Brian is perhaps best known for playing Walter White in Breaking Bad, which I've never seen, shamefully, but it is on my list, so I might get there eventually. But I know him best for Get A Job and for Why Him and Godzilla. And I'm very happy to have his autograph in my collection. The amazing Brian Cranston. And now for the third one, let's have a look. Oh, I love it when I do it this way. Have a look. It is <gasps> Toby Jones again. Cheers, Daniel. Toby Jones. I've got this picture signed like three times now. Let's just pretend this is the first one. He's also signed the picture that I sent to him, which is previously signed by Matthew Lewis, and this looks absolutely amazing. I don't know if I should send it to a third person to try and get it signed just there, or if I should just leave it as it is, but I absolutely love this. It's signed by Toby Jones and Matthew Lewis. Like I've just said. The next one is this one here, to Daniel, Toby Jones, rubber, which looks absolutely amazing in person. The camera isn't doing it justice. And the last one, if I can pick it up, is to Daniel, Toby Jones, tweet tweet. Cool. Absolutely love these. Thank you very much, Toby Jones. So yeah. Envelope 3 was a TTM success from Toby Jones. Thank you, Toby. Now for envelope 4, let's have a look. Let's have a look. <gasps> it's Kem! Yes, Kem! To Daniel, lots of love, Kem. Thank you very much, Kem. To Daniel, lots of love, Kem. Thank you very much, Kem. Kem is a reality star. I know him best for Love Island and is currently competing on Dancing on Ice. 
And yeah, I thought I'd send her the venue and obviously it paid off, it worked. I'm very happy to have pictures signed by Kem. I do already have a CD signed by Kem because him and Chris Hughes released a song called Little Bit Leave It. And yeah, I'm very excited to add pictures to my collection from Kem Satinay. Thank you, Kem. And now for the final envelope. Let's have a look. Here it is. Oh, it's Brooke Vincent. Daniel, lots of love. Brooke, Sophie. Yes, Brooke Vincent. Thank you very much. Now, just like Kem, I sent to Brooke via Dancing on Ice because she's currently competing on the show and she signed both of the pictures that I sent to her. I think I sent the third. Oh, I did. It's in the envelope. So this is Brooke Vincent, who plays Sophie Webster on Coronation Street. I sent to her at Dancing on Ice because she's currently competing on the show and obviously I got a reply. I'm over the moon to get these back because I've written to Brooke before at Coronation Street and never had a reply. So to get personalised ones, finally, really means the world. Thank you very much, Brooke. I absolutely love you. So today I received a Via Venue Success from Brooke Vincent, a Via Venue Success from Kem Satinay, a TTM Success from Toby Jones, a Via Venue Success from Brian Cranston, and a Via Venue Success from Greg Davis. What an amazing mail day. Thank you, Autograph Guards. I love you. Today is Wednesday the 31st of January, and today I received one envelope of autographs in the post. I have opened it off camera though, so I'm just going to show you what it is. It's an Emmerdale success from the amazing Sally Dexter. Now Sally signed a cast card for me as requested. To dearest Daniel with much love, Sally Dexter. As well as this, she also signed a picture that I sent to her. Just there, Sally Dexter, Faith. Of course, Sally plays Faith Dingle. And as well as that, on the back she's also wrote me a lovely note. Dearest Daniel, thank you so much for your lovely letter. So sorry it's taken this long to reply and that I've run out of paper. You're right though, we laugh a lot working on the show. They are the nicest people here. Maybe one day you'll join us. Big love to you and thanks again, SD. So that's really cool. I waited absolutely ages for this, although not as long as most Emmerdale stars take. So I'm grateful for that. But it's a perfect way to end January because Sally Dexter plays my favourite Emmerdale character. And yeah, I'm very excited to add her to my collection finally. So one TTM success from the amazing Sally Dexter. Thank you, Sally. Today is Thursday the 1st of February, and today I received two lots of autographs in the post. The first one was an eBay purchase from the 75% sale that was happening last week and the week before, from the amazing Idina Menzel. Now, I got Idina because I know her best for playing Rachel's mum in Glee, and she also played Princess Elsa in Frozen. And because I'm starting a animation folder, I thought I'd get this. So yeah, another one for the Disney collection. This one was only about £8.50, including postage, so not too bad at all. And yeah, hard to get it. Absolutely love it. Although I wish the seller actually sent me the other one, because the signature on the other one was much better. But I can't complain, i still got her in my collection. So yeah, Edina Menzel. And the second autograph I received today was actually a TTM success via a private address. So unfortunately, I cannot share the address, so please don't ask. But it's my second autograph from the amazing Daniel Radcliffe. Now I sent Daniel four items and he's kindly signed three of them for me. This 10 by 8 to Daniel of Daniel Radcliffe, which I absolutely love. As you can see, it's a bit beat up in the corner, but I'm going to frame it anyway, so it doesn't really matter. I absolutely love this. Then a 5 by 7 picture to Daniel of Daniel Radcliffe. As you can see, he's put a sticky note on it and it's still attached. So. Yeah, don't mind because I love it anyway. And the third thing that he signed was my DVD cover for What If. Didn't personalise this one, but I don't care. Looks absolutely amazing. Like I said, I did send a fourth thing, which was a Harry Potter 10 by 8 That wasn't signed or returned, but to be honest, I don't really mind. But yeah, I'm very happy with these. These look absolutely amazing, especially this one. This one's my favourite. And yeah. I'm very pleased with this. So yeah, private success from Daniel Radcliffe. Today is Friday the 2nd of February and today I received three lots of autographs in the post. 
I have opened them off camera, so I'm just going to show you what they are. The first one was a Via Venue Success from Emmerdale actor, John Middleton. I sent John two pictures and he's kindly signed both of them for me. This one, All the Best Daniel, John Middleton. And this picture of him as Ashley Thomas. Two Daniel Best Wishes, John Middleton. As you can see, this one kind of got a bit beat up. No idea how. But also my return envelope was torn in half and then sellotaped in the middle as John actually destroyed it himself, as proved in this note. Dear Daniel, thank you so much for your astonishingly kind letter. All the very best, John Middleton. P.S. I'm afraid I ripped your SAA. So that's what happened. But yeah, I'm absolutely over the moon to get personalised autographs from John Middleton. I do already have him in my collection on a cast card, but I thought I'd try again to try and get personalised. And luckily it paid off. It was a very quick via venue success, sent to the New Alexandra Theatre in Birmingham. As you can see, he received it on the 31st of January. So yeah, very quick. Thank you very much, John. John Middleton. The second autographs I received today were another via venue success, this time from actor David Morrissey, who I know best for playing Jackson Lake in the next Doctor episode of Doctor Who. I sent David two pictures, this one here as Jackson Lake, which is part two Dan, David M. And also this picture, again, personalised to Dan, David M. To be honest, I didn't think he would reply. To be completely honest, I didn't think he would reply, so I'm very excited and very happy to add him to my collection. The risk paid off, and I'm very happy with it. I absolutely love this one. It looks amazing, and I'm very happy to add him to my Doctor Who folder. So yeah, a quick via venue success from David Morrissey. And the final autograph I received today was actually a gift from my friend Mark of Mark's Autograph Collection. Thank you very much, Mark. Mark kindly wrote to the actor Chris Harper, who I know best for playing Nathan in Coronation Street. And because Mark actually sent a picture that Chris actually sends back as a cast card, Mark sent me the picture as a gift, completely unaware that I'd actually wrote to Chris myself. So hopefully soon I'll get my Chris reply. But for now, thank you very much, Mark. I absolutely love it. I'm very happy to add Chris to my collection. Obviously he played Nathan in Coronation Street, who was a paedophile, who was grooming Bethany Platt. Absolutely hated his character, but I thought Chris was an amazing actor, and I'm very happy to add him to my collection. Like I said, I did write to Chris myself, so hopefully I get a reply from him as well. So yeah, thank you very much Mark for thinking of me, and for sending me your spare. I truly appreciate it. Sorry that the surprise was ruined, because obviously I wrote to him myself. But yeah, rest assured, I absolutely love it and I'm very happy to add him to my collection nonetheless. So Chris Harper, which was a gift from my friend Mark. Thank you very much, Mark. David Morrissey, which was via venue. And John Middleton, which was also via venue.